and Brad, the two most famous physical therapists on the internet. Hi folks, I'm Bob Schrupp, physical therapist. Oh, Brad Heinick, physical therapist. And together we are the most famous physical therapists on the internet. In our opinion, of course. Today Bob. we're going to talk about the best darn, I was going to use a different D, but I thought this is a family the, show, Brad. Very good, the Bob. Best darn product for knee replacements. Stretches, exercises, range of motion, flexion, extension. Things and, that make uh, the knee work well. We love this, don't we? Yeah, the new step is <laughs> one of our home, you know, it's just... It's used for so many things, but really good for knees. Yeah, it, and because you, the person's in control, so when he pushes this arm up, it actually flexes the knee. Right. And, and when you're in pain, you want to know that you're the one applying the pain, not someone else, <laughs> right? It's much more relaxing, much better results. And the seat moves up, right, Brad? Yeah, so, watch it. So if this is like, oh, I need a little more bend there, we just simply do this, slide it forward, and voila. You get much more. You can knee see bend. the tape he's got on there, and the reason he's got on there, he's not trying to become a general or something with his stripes down his pants or something <laughs> like that. He's actually showing how much knee flexion there is with the black pants. All right, just so, make it easier to see. No, this is a wonderful unit. Uh, I, I'm sure you see them in, in a lot of times uh, facilities, fitness facilities, and such like that because right. they're. You can sit and you can work out, and it's great for cardio and, and everything else for right. strengthening. So. And they're extremely well built. But there's a there's one thing about it. Well, no, Brad. You know the thing is, I I you've been such a good business partner. I think you know what I'm going to buy one for you. Yeah, sure. Let's see. Um, how much are they? You know. Well, the base price is about three thousand seven hundred ninety-five dollars, and then it goes up from there. But it'll last you your whole life. I guarantee you that. Okay. Well, I think we're going to have to come up with another alternative. <laughs> maybe something a little better for home that yeah uh, that maybe could save on the pocketbook. Right. <laughs> So as an alternative, Brad, uh, we better pick out something that people can maybe possibly afford. Although, you know, if you want to buy one of those new steps, we'll put it in our product section down I, below. And you I've can had a, a few. I have had a few patients purchase them for home. Obviously, they can afford it. Yeah. Most people have difficulty with it. One other problem with the new step, by the way, it's not portable. <laughs> Brad and I just had to wheel it out of here, and it's very heavy. Mm -hmm. the, as of, as opposed to this next product that we're going to mention, it's the knee glide. And the knee glide, by the way. You can carry around with one finger, can't you, Brad? It's less very than, portable. Less than three pounds. You watch this, Brad. I can do curls with this. With one <laughs> finger. Finger curls, <laughs> sure. Yeah. Uh, by the way, Brad, I, I missed out on doing this earlier. If you are new to our channel, by the way, please take a second to subscribe to us. We provide videos on how to stay healthy, fit, pain-free, and we upload every day. There you go. Also, go over to Facebook and like us because we like to be liked. We're All right, likeable. Brad. We're very likable. So um, this is a very simple device that um, it, it's got a little... Uh, foot plate on there that you can easily put on and work on while you're on, you know, sitting on the on a chair. Right, just like this. You can do it on a bed, you can do it on a chair, and it very easily slides so you can, in a relaxed manner, get that knee bend. You know, if you're, if you're with a therapist, you know you're going to get this thing out, and they're going to measure, and they want to see how far they can bend it. And they're going to say, push a little more. Well, with this, you can easily use your other leg and push to get that 90, 100, 110, 120 degrees knee bend after that knee surgery. Yeah, what we recommend is that you, you, know, you work it for a while, get it loosened up, and then you actually cross at the ankles first. Yeah, there, and, like and that. And then you pull back. Sure. And then after a while, when, when you get, to, you know, you're getting improvement, then you actually got to put it off at the toe yep. and push back even further. And one thing that's really nice about this device is you can go downhill with it, which gives you a little more. Sometimes you just need a little little different angle on it, and that can give you just what you need to get that extra range of motion that you're looking for. Yeah, and I gotta tell the story, Brad. We had a patient that we had seen before the knee glide was available, and um, we worked with her for a month, and she had a contracture in her knee, and the most we could get her knee up to was 70 degrees. Mm -hmm. We just worked and worked and worked. Sure. We, we took her off of therapy. Um, she came back. The doctor wanted us to try to get to 90 degrees so they could do the surgery on her. So we took, in this instance, we used the knee glide. We got to 95 degrees. I mean, it was just, that yeah. was the only difference between what we had right. done before. And, right. and so I became a big believer. I really like the fact when you're working with somebody that you can, you know, really easily just with the, your, your foot, if your foot's on there, I can just give a, little, a bit of a stretch here. And, and even measure right. while I'm, you know, if I'm working with you, I can easily measure while right. I'm holding the, uh, you know, oh, the foot yeah. in place. The therapists are just absolutely going to love this thing. Now, the other thing that you can do 
Well, you can put the strap on the middle, Brad. You know, on the middle section. You know what I'm saying, do you? No. <laughs> right here. Put it on this one and then pull back. But you got something else in mind, right? Yeah, uh, I was. Oh, uh, he's going this way. I wanted to go. Just using a little leverage and a little ingenuity. If you got a tight knee and you want to get Brad a little. Brad is Mr. Mechanical here, so I, I should know better than try to mm. make suggestions to him because he's got ideas. <laughs> and, and, and now, you know, very easily can just pull forward. And, you know, this is the uh, yoga, strap. yoga strap. It's got little loops in there. You can easily just get your hand in there and get that range of motion. You know, sometimes knees are a little stubborn. You want to yeah. get that extra uh, leverage. And this does it very nicely. We like the yoga strap. Uh, I mean, you can use it for stretching other parts of the body then too. So oh, it, right. it would come in handy. Um, sure. for, for And there's actually different ways that you could use it. Um, you could actually, if I was up here, Brad, and I was up on a bed. Oh, I yeah. I could take it like this. And this is what I was talking about. You take it on. You can tell where the middle is because that's where the tag is. Yep. So I can go like this. And you might put a towel down on your heel to make it a little more comfortable. But you can see how I can pull like this. Yep. There. Let's I mean, get for it, should yeah. Be. So I can really, you know, and I'm kind of going at a different angle here now. Now right. I can really, and I can put my hands in the loops and I can really give some uh, stress on the knee really get it into that flexion. This could be used early on in the right after surgery when you're in the hospital bed yet or at home in bed and it's still pretty uh, limited as far as how the range is. So Brad, can this be used for more than just flexion? Say no <laughs> more, <laughs> Bob. <laughs> so yes, you can use it to straighten the knee out too. It actually works out kind of cool. You're gonna need a little bit of a platform, a stool or something. Yeah, um, it, it depends on the, on the height. I mean, you, you can do it on the floor and it'll work. Um, and we're just going to push down like this. Depending on the height of the chair, the, the right. size of the, the person, if you're a shorter person, you may want to get it up on a platform and you can use a, a chair or, or a stool. This works nice. And then we're just, it just slides so nice and easy. We're going to push down here. And what this is works to me is the pressure on, pressure yep, off, Brad. You know, sure. you can pressure on, yep. pressure off, pressure on, pressure off. So uh, it's just, you know, it, it's a real simple device. And uh, uh, Brad and I should let you know that we created it. But yeah, we, <laughs> maybe we, that's why we're big advocates of it. We did but, invent it. We have a patent on it. And, you know, it's a real nice deal you can you can hang it on a wall and get it out of the way real easy. For yeah, I think the, th the thing about it, Brad, is is that you know, you Brad and I ask ourselves the question: What is the best product that you want to use after knee replacement? And it was the new step. But second, this is the second by far. I can't right. think of anything right. else that would work to help increase right. knee flexion right. as well as this does. So. The, the new step, almost exclusively, going to be in the clinic. A few people will purchase them, but this pretty much, if you can, you know, anybody can afford. This yeah. is going to work on their knee. After you have a, a knee surgery for a couple thousand bucks, you maybe can go ahead. And <laughs> if you can get a knee surgery for a couple thousand dollars. Yeah, really. Well, what is it? What, I don't, what do they run now? Probably I, eight I, to 10, 12? No, I think at 20 or 30. Are they really? I, I've never seen the bill, and usually uh, the patients don't talk about it too little much. little sticker shock there for me. So, <laughs> All right, everybody. Remember, Brad and I can fix just about anything. Except for a broken heart. Oh, there it is. Hey. All right, thanks for watching.